But I, as a Glober, you, you're automatically right, aren't you? So I, I, all I thought was, you know, I'm right, you're wrong, because I know the earth will go, because I've been told it since I was a kid, not because I proved it to myself. Not heard the word bent used in ages. Hold on, though. <laughs> yeah, as soon as you're proven Thank wrong, you, you're going to have a little paddy through the person pointing out how stupid you are and talk through it. So in the vain hope that people won't realise how stupid you are, if you try and talk through the top of me telling my audience how stupid you are, assuming that flat earthers make up fallacies like begging the question, only to go away and Google search it and realise how stupid you are. Oh my God. And there she is right on cue while I point out how stupid she is to interrupt me. JQ kept answering with that. And it's not like I ever e-beg. Be sure to smash the super chat, by the way. We want an outrage. <laughs> is that the point? What I said was, this is Nathan's living. If you don't like it, don't send the money. That being said, I just want to say hello to all of the new people listening. Um, that's like Sleeping Warrior said. Um, there's a link to uh, join. Yeah, it's, it's me. It's, it's me, uh, Nathan. Yeah, it's Tommy Hench. <laughs> hello, I'm Tommy. just uh, just listening in. If you're a boxing fan, go and subscribe to Tommy Hench. Is that the name of your channel, Tommy Hench? Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah. Subscribe. Does commentary? Do you like gives boxing? His anyway, go ahead, Tommy. Sorry, I just wanted to chat you out a little bit. Go oh ahead. yeah, if you, if, you, if you like, but yeah, thanks for that. Appreciate that, Nathan. Um, all the work that you're doing relentlessly every single day is unmatched by anybody. Honestly, like, uh, uh, kudos to you. And I know you get a lot of stick, but these 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 people can't answer straight questions and. They, they're, they're totally intellectually dishonest. It's, uh, it's good to hear you, you're doing what you're doing so consistently for so long. You know what I mean? You're a champion. You are a champion. Oh, well, I appreciate it. Um, really. Especially coming no from worries, someone man. who's Keep a former it. opponent, <laughs> which is weird. <laughs> there we go. I know, man. I know, but so at the end of the day, I didn't, even, I, didn't, I didn't know my own math, did I? I didn't know what the R value was. I didn't know how, they, how it's obtained. I didn't know anything about it. But I, as a Glober... You're automatically right, aren't you? So I, I, all I thought was, you know, I'm right, you're wrong, because I know the earth will go, because I've been told it since I was a kid, not because I proved it to myself. Um, we got Napso not uh, challenging you, Nathan, in chat, uh, but he's in voice chat. Uh, tell us all about it, Napso not. What you got to say? About fallacies and stuff? You just want to stay, want to stay on chat? I'm a she, first of all. And okay. what does that matter? What does it matter if I'm in voice chat or in the regular chat? What difference does it? Make? Very nice to have you. Because you're challenging Nathan. But he's right. You can talk to him. Why are you white knighting for him? What's white knighting? Did you have a question? And it's very nice. To are have you, you brother. fighting his battle for him? Nap. It's nice to have you. What would you like to be go? What would you like to go by? What? I what can I call you? Up. What can? I, what do you go by? Oh, naps. Nap. Very nice to have you. Did, did you have a question you wanted to ask? No, I had no question. I don't know why he felt the need to bring me up, <laughs> but you know. Well, you're showboating in chat, so by requesting you to speak is a challenge for you to talk. How am I showboating? Why are, am I talking about you personally? No. So, what is your issue? I think I think what they're trying to get. Uh, is... But I've got an issue. With, I've got an issue. With you. Okay. Well, she she's here now. Was there something that you were in chat discussing that perhaps you wanted to discuss with us? That would be lovely. If so, if not, don't worry about it. I just made a comment about the terminology you guys use. It's just funny. That's the only thing I said. <clears throat> Perfect. What was it specifically? It's just like making up all these like, oh, it's begging the question fallacy and blah, blah. I'm like, I've never even heard of that before. It's like you just make up words. So let me get it straight. Because you've never heard of it, you think I've made it up? <laughs> Definitely made up. Oh, really? Have you that. by chance Google searched it? So. Say again. I just, I just, 
it <laughs> bewilders me as to why somebody would claim that I'm making something up, having not actually checked by way of a quick Google search to see if it is actually something that you can find easily. Have you done that? We're okay. <laughs> Let's look it up. Let, let's Google. Let's do that. No problem. We'll just establish while you're doing that, that so far you've claimed I've made something up. We'll see how this goes. I'm telling you right now, this is going to be bad. You don't just the wrong trees, sister. How are you getting on there, Nap? Would you like to read out what you've got in front of you? Hello? Why is everybody so silent? We're waiting for Nap it's in the chat. She's claimed I've made up stuff like begging the question fallacy because oh, I'm her, looking she's at now going to interrupt me when there was long pauses for her to talk, of course. So, she's claimed I've made up a fallacy. Begging the question, never heard of it. You made it up. So I've said, go and Google it. Let's see if I have made it up or not. And now there's lots of silences. You yeah, constantly make up things. Like, you're like the stereotypical Why don't you flat earth. If I found it up so funny to me. <laughs> I see. So far, you've specifically claimed I've made up begging the question because you've never heard of it. Have you Google searched it yet? That's no. That's where we're at. I think you like to just make up fallacies. Yeah, I heard that I three times. That. We're not deaf. I heard you. When un you are under the impression it. I make stuff up. We understand that. You've said it three times. Now we're trying to ask if I have but it's okay. or not. It's okay. And you seem to be talking okay. through me. Okay. So have you Google Brilliant. searched it, love? Breathe. Thank you. You seem to be muttering quite a lot. Can you just answer yes or no? Have you Googled something which you have claimed I have made up? Yes or no? How long is this going to take? It would not. Let me tell you something. Let me tell you something, you stupid woman. I have not made up begging the question. You are just a retard who assumes I'm wrong because I'm a flat earther. Now I'm going to tear a strip off you, you dumb bitch. I have not made up begging the question. You're just a dumb bitch. And you don't know what I'm talking about because you don't know and are ignorant. Therefore, your ignorance has led you to accuse me of making stuff up. I haven't. You're thick. Do you understand me, thicko? Hello? You are ignorant. It is a real fallacy. To assume one's outcome is to beg the question. Because you haven't heard of it doesn't mean I've made it up because I'm a flat earther, you complete idiot. <laughs> Laugh it up, you stupid bitch. I have not made up begging the question, you daft bint. Wait, calm down. Calm down? You've accused me of making shit up. I haven't. You're just ignorant. Now I'm tearing a strip off you for being an ignorant, globe-believing retard who assumes because I'm a flat earther, I've made up begging the question. No love. You are. <laughs> so you still think I've made up begging the question, do you, you dumb shit? <laughs> Laugh it up, you dumb shit. You're being humiliated by a flat earther for your assumption that I've made up the fallacy of begging the question. I haven't. You're just thick. No. This is, this, this is what ignorant. you do. You stutter for me, you stammering dickhead. I haven't made up begging the question. You've told me I've made it up. You're wrong because you're ignorant. You've also, because you're completely batshit insane, told us why you've made it up. Because you assume I've made it up because I'm a flat earther. What, therefore, you know better... And because you've never heard of it, it doesn't exist and I've made it up. No, that displays your complete ignorance of fallacy, love. That makes you thick. Are you done? Are you done? What, telling you how stupid you are? No, I'll sit here indefinitely and tear a strip off you for your total ignorance of fallacy. I assume you've now Googled it up and realised your error. I haven't made it up. It's not something that doesn't exist simply because it's been stated by a flat earther. It does exist, you're just a globe believer who doesn't research a thing and can't even be asked to Google search it before going on a live show and claiming I've made it up. You stupid idiot. <laughs> Laugh it up. You're the thicko here, globe believer. Let's get that clear. Do you realise how stupid you are? Is he done? What, telling you how stupid you are? No, I could do it all day. I get people like you coming and assuming that I've made stuff up because I'm a flat earther all the time. You have literally told me I've made up a begging the question fallacy. It doesn't exist because you've never heard of it. I've never heard something so stupid. You fucking 
thick. Yeah, swear for me, bitch. You're thick as fuck, bitch. You're a joke. Yeah, you're thick as fuck and you're stuttering too. How do my nuts taste, you stupid retard? You're a fucking joke. Yeah, yeah, you're being humiliated and berated for claiming, without any concession, by the way, you're still under the apprehension that you're in the right here, presumably having Googled it and realised how wrong you are, having been directed to do so by the only person with any common sense here. Between you and I, that is. You being thick, going on a live show and claiming begging the questions made up. You don't love me. I run a show, you stupid cow! You stupid cow. Yes, that's precisely what you are, love. You've come here and literally claimed up, but because I'm a flat earther, begging the question's been made up. I'm a flat earther. That's the thing. You're not. Yeah, and I know what a begging the question fallacy is, unlike you, love. You fucking put. Yeah, you don't know what begging the question is and thought it was made up, you stupid idiot. We have a whole bunch of. Yeah, you thought begging the question was made up now, didn't you, love? Every word. Sorry, are you going to address the fact that you thought, because you're a stupid idiot, that begging the question was made up? Hello! You thought begging the question was made up, you stupid bint! <laughs> you're a fucking joke. You keep swearing at me. You've got no reason to. You're the idiot here. You literally thought a fallacy that's well detailed with a simple Google search was made up because I'm a flat earther stating it and you didn't know what it was. Well, if I don't know it and a flat earther saying it must be made up, you arrogant twat. You'll be doing this stupid bullshit for the rest of your life. What? Stupid bullshit like going on a live show and claiming begging the questions made up? That kind of stupid shit. It's a real job, Nathan. This is my job. I'm paid to do this to humiliate arrogant, globe-believing dicks like you who will literally go on to a live show and claim that a begging the question fallacy doesn't exist. <laughs> yeah, laugh it up, you stupid cow. <laughs> yeah, laugh it up. That's how thick you are. This is hilarious. What? How stupid you are? I'm laughing in your face. You're what have you got to say for yourself about the begging the question story. fallacy you came in to claim I'd made up? Do you feel stupid? You should. Okay. Don't mutter. Explain your stupidity to us You're and the live joke. audience. You're not fucking worth a conversation. Oh, really? But you're worth coming here to leave comments in my chat that I don't read and then literally tell a live audience that begging the question isn't real? You stupid mong. You stupid mong. Yeah, keep repeating back my insults that are based on the demonstrable fact that you don't know what a begging the question fallacy is. And because you don't know what it is, you thought I made it up. Grow up. Sorry, grow up. Three-year-olds do. Sorry, growing up would involve educating myself on what a fallacy was before I went on a live show and told the host that he's made it up. Look, like a bunch of idiots. Sorry, is that all you've got to call me an idiot 15 times through the fact that you thought begging the question was made up? Is that really all you've got? You do nothing else but yell. It's just like making up all these like, oh, it's begging the question fallacy and blah, blah. I'm like, I've never even heard of that before. It's like you just make up words. Like, yell at idiots who think begging the question's made up. You ever going to address the actual point here, love? Hey, God. You ever going to address the actual problem you've got here, idiot? Ah, oh, Nathan. You going to address the point? Carry hey. on. I don't need permission. I need you to address the fact you thought begging the question was made up, you idiot. Sat herself, sat herself on mute. Which she can't add Are on you me through me like she's doing the moment the silence is broken by me. She's not going to talk unless she can talk straight through me with insults. Like you're doing right now? Oh. You are thick as shit. Demonstrably so based on the fact that you claim begging the question was made up. Oh, so it's begging the question. I've never even heard of that. You just make up words. Simply because you've never heard of it. That makes you a demonstrable spastic. You don't have to like it, love. It's a fact. You can try and talk through it. My audience will still hear it. And every single one of them knows how stupid you are. I'm... 
Congratulations, lady. You're the dumbest grow individual up. to ever walk in here. But grow up is your response. Do you still think begging the question was made up by me, love? Yes. Grow up, act like an adult. Sorry, is grow up your response to me asking you if you still think begging the question's made up? You're a fucking joke. Is you're a fucking idiot your response to do you still think begging the question was made up by me? Oh, it's begging the question. You just make up words. I think you're a fucking liar. And is that you saying yes, you still think begging the question was made up by me? I think you are a liar. Uh, so begging the question was a lie made up by me then? You use stereotypical language. Sorry, begging the question's the subject matter that you seem terrified of because it demonstrates how stupid you are. Oh, it's begging the question. You just make up words. You are. Smart. Yeah, I am smart, love. Considerably smarter than your dumbass, who literally, because you couldn't be asked to do a Google search, claim a flat earther had made up a fallacy. You just make up words. Off the top of their head. Somebody who broadcasts literally to hundreds of people daily, is going to go to the extent and stupidity of making up a fallacy like no one would ever call me on it. But you think you're so smart because you've never heard of it to claim I've made it up. That literally makes you thick, love. Like, really thick. They talk shit about you. They do. Sorry, are you ever going to address this begging the question you came in to tell me I've made up or not? Are you ever going to address that, love? You make up a lot of stuff. Sorry, you keep obfuscating away from the problem you've got with your claim, I made up a fallacy, only to then cause a lot of ruckus when it's pointed out how stupid you look for simply Google searching it and proving yourself wrong. I don't give a fuck. <laughs> you don't care how stupid you look. I've only oh. heard Ann humming from her in the last few minutes. I went Damn. for a cup of coffee, right? I went for a cup of coffee to come back to hear somebody... Coming with the most ridiculous thing. And ridiculous. is this the level of desperation that they've got that they can only challenge us on just complete idiocy? Nothing to do with the nature of the earth because they've lost there. All they can do now is come in and make something up and then just realistically just sound a little insane, frankly. And talking about calling people childish, nothing more childish than constantly ignoring somebody yeah, and then just insulting and just throwing straightforward ad hoc, which is all I've heard from that lady, which... And one other thing, not heard the word bin used in ages, well done, though. Yeah, as soon as you're proven Thank wrong, you. you're going to have a little paddy through the person pointing out how stupid you are and talk through it. So in the vain hope that people won't realise how stupid you are if you try and talk through the top of me telling my audience how stupid you are, for assuming that flat earthers make up fallacies like begging the question, only to go away and Google search it and realise how fucking stupid you are. Oh my god. And there she is right on cue while I point out how stupid she is to interrupt me. Because it's hard. It's hard to hear it. Hard to hear that you're stupid in front of a live audience. 150 people live listening to how stupid you are, love. That's really difficult for you, I know. And you're going to attempt to obfuscate that fact being pointed out to my live audience by talking through me. Yeah, nice try, love. It's not going to work. I am going to point out how stupid it is to claim that a fallacy's been made up simply because I'm a flat earther and you haven't bothered typing it into Google, you thick bint. Yeah, I will point that out over and over again while you attempt to obfuscate away from your lack of humility in this regard, total lack of humility, and your constant attempts to interrupt it. Yeah, you're not going to get that chance, you thick bint. No, 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 I'll just point out how stupid you are indefinitely while you rage through me thinking that you're going to get through to my audience to obfuscate the fact that you're thick. You are. You're like every Globe believer that comes here. It was detailed beautifully by Tommy before you got here. Tommy told us all about how he thought he was right just because he was on a Globe. Well, I, as a Glober, you, you're automatically right, aren't you? So I, I, all I thought was, you know, I'm right, you're wrong, because I know the Earth's a Globe, because I've been told it since I was a kid, not because I proved it to myself. And we were telling our audience that it's flat. So obviously we're wrong. Obviously we've made up this fallacy. We're flat earthers, right, aren't we, love? So of course we've made up the fallacy. You can automatically assume that with your arrogance, that we're stupid and you're smart. And then you get in front of 150 people and get demonstrate just how stupid you actually are. Uh, she spoke through every word of that. She didn't listen to a single I'd like word. I'd like to know what money from people. These dumbasses is going to give it to you. Yeah, so are you, you think begging the Robert? question's made up? Let's see how many... I'm going to start counting it off how many times I have to ask this question. 
you can ask the same question to your fucking blue in the face. I don't give a fuck. It's making the question made up. You're dealing with a troll. How long are you going to do this? And that's not a troll. That's a normal person. She's a woman. A woman at the end of no, a month a troll. Troll, sharing her pain after being humiliated. So she's going to attempt to obfuscate it at every opportunity, talk through it. Troll is the behaviour. Person is what we're dealing with. Person who's been humiliated. And then fight or flight kicks in. So she's going to scream and rage through me, pointing out just how stupid she is at every opportunity she's going to get. Doesn't make her a troll or a non-person. Just an embarrassment to her globe belief. Uh, right. this, this is not a, this is this is not a troll because simply because I have conversations like this with people that I'm like. Well, I mean, whether they take on troll behavior, um, they're for real. They're not doing this on purpose. They just think they're right, and that's as far as their intellect goes. To this come guy, on the show and think begging the question is not real? Real. <laughs> Shout out to Phoenix Rising 86. Indeed, deal. Yeah. Oh, my God. Willing, well, willfully ignorant and refusing to use Google search. Indeed. It's pathetic. If you're going to go in front of a live audience and claim someone's made some makeup, the least you can do is tap it into Google first, right? It's absolutely pathetic. But that's the level of arrogance that we have to deal with when someone's got a globe belief. Well, I've got a globe belief. They're obviously wrong. So much so, every word that comes out of their mouth I can challenge for a live audience as being made up, only to be demonstrated completely incorrect with a simple Google search, pointed out and asked to be done by the flat earther I'm accusing. You'd think that you'd have the logical... Uh, inclination to actually do that yourself but that's the level of stupidity you need to be pointed out that maybe do a google search before you claim that i've made it up i had to point that out to you love that's how stupid Nathan, you are there's there's a, there's a million and one fallacies out there right but one of the most famous ones is the one that's being i'm just aghast that uh, you know it's not just it's, it's ignorance at, at mess and then topped with a, a real good dose of arrogance on top to follow it. But fundamentally, the, the level of ignorance to come in and not know that fallacy and not have heard of it, uh, and then the arrogance to then say, because you've not, and attack you, it, 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 it is either complete trolling or really, really very, very ignorant. Yep. It's outright stupidity on a massive scale.